Hey guys, welcome back to the Tennisshare channel. It's that time again, new phone season. Whether you've just picked up the latest flagship or upgraded your backup phone, there's always one tricky part, moving all your data. Sounds stressful, right? Don't worry, I've got you covered. Stick around, and I'll walk you through a couple of super easy ways to transfer everything. Oh, and don't forget to drop a like before we start. Let's dive in. Method 1. Use Smart Switch to transfer data. If your new phone is a Samsung, then Smart Switch is hands down the easiest option. Here's what you do. First, make sure Smart Switch is on both devices. Download and open Smart Switch on both phones. On your old phone, tap Send Data on your new one. Tap Receive Data. You can use Wi-Fi or a cable. Let's go with Wi-Fi here. Next, use your old phone to scan the QR code on your new phone to connect. After scanning, wait for about two minutes to establish the connection. Once connected, you can choose to transfer all your data or just select specific items like accounts, call logs, contacts, and messages. There's also an option to pick the files you want to transfer. After making your selection, tap Next. Then, decide whether to set it up as a new phone, and the transfer will begin. This might take a little time. And once it's done, you can check to confirm everything transferred successfully. If both your phones are Samsung or support this tool, it's super fast and requires zero extra setup. Method 2. Use Android Switch for transfer. If you're using a Google Pixel or another Android phone, transferring data is super easy during the setup process. For example, when setting up a new Pixel, you'll see the option to transfer your data right after activation. If your device is already set up, you can reset it to factory settings to go back to the transfer screen or you can use Android Switch. For Pixel 9 and newer models, you can transfer data without resetting the phone. If you prefer, you can also use a computer for a seamless transfer, though not all Android devices support this method. If that's the case, we can move on to the next method. Method 3. Transfer data with Googles. Next up, let's talk about Google Backup and Sync. This method is great if you're switching to a different Android brand or just like keeping your data in the cloud. Here's the deal. On your old phone, go to Settings, then select Accounts and Backup, and back everything up to Google. Make sure the backup finishes and syncs to your Google account. On your new phone, log into that same account. Go to Account Sync and pick the stuff you want to bring over. That's it, you've got your data back. This one's super reliable and also doubles as long-term cloud storage. Tips, if you want to transfer data from Android to iPhone. Now, if you've made the jump from Android to iPhone, don't panic. I recommend using eTransgo. It moves your data straight over without having to reset your iPhone. Plus, it lets you transfer data between iPhones and Android phones, and it's super easy to use. And you can grab it from the link in the description. And there you have it, two simple ways to move data between Android phones, plus a bonus tip for switching to iPhone. If this video helped, make sure to like and share it with friends who might need it. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one.